Hello? Can I help you? Let me put you on, let me put you on, let me put you on. My grandma put me on. I will continue to reapply this slip gloss for the rest of the night. What is up beautiful people? How's everybody doing today? I am so glad to be back. There's just no better way to put it. I have just been lacking motivation and that's normal. It's literally normal. There's nothing wrong with that. It's not gonna last and so we're back. So today's a Sunday. Usually Sundays I take for my self-care days. Um, I have a party slash date to attend tonight. You guys are basically just gonna be getting ready with me. I have to do my makeup. I have to, you know, get presentable, like get cute, like, you know. So that's basically what we're gonna be doing. I'm gonna be doing my makeup. I have so many things I have to say that I'm not saying anything at all. If you don't already follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok, and if you're not subscribed, go do that. So let's start getting ready because I am gonna be late, as always. For my makeup, hashtag makeup routine. I'm not a beauty guru, this is not a beauty channel. Let's just get to it. I went to Ulta yesterday. I got some new makeup because something something just wasn't working out with me. Something was breaking me out. So these are the NYX HD Studio Photogenic Concealers. Um, and I am pretty pale right now. I've been losing my color. It's been raining every day. Is that gonna work? Oh my God, it works. Package from Fashion Nova came in today. Um, uh, Fashion Nova did a dress campaign, so they sent me some of their dresses. We're gonna be popping off in a new outfit tonight. And then I go in with this darker shade for my contour. This is not the most stable setup. And bronze me up. Then I'm gonna use this blush that I've literally been using for, I don't know how long. Also, I've been really on my spiritual journey and i've gotten into reading let me put you on it is ask and it is given learning to manifest your desires hashtag woke um i saw this girl post about it on tiktok basically talking about how this book changed her life and i was like oh my god me too and now here i am a brand new bitch also let me put you on 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 Less than $10 at Ulta, literally the best, the best drugstore mascaras. Oh my god, it's raining. Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. <sighs> this is what the rain does to me. The rain makes me so tired. Okay, this is definitely my new favorite. My setup. This is the NYX lip liner. Also just got it at Ulta the other day. I just love the color. I'm on my Kylie Jenner shit. Does that look bad? Oh my God, does that look bad? Don't lie to me. I don't care. I really, I, I do care. I do care. I care too much about what people think about me. Let me fix. So this one is too, oh my God, I'm bleeding. The vampires are going crazy right now. Can you tell I just watched Twilight? Tell me why I was re-watching Twilight for like the fifth time. And I just keep realizing how shitty the fucking acting was. But you know what? Maybe it wasn't even bad acting. Maybe they were just supposed to play like really awkward characters. Hold on. Get, get on. I'm going to go in with the same highlight that I've been using for the past lifetime just put a little bit of highlight i'm also gonna put some highlight underneath my brow i really hope my feet are not showing on camera because that would be that at that point i'm done filming like that's pretty much my makeup like is that disappointing this is the last thing that we're gonna do i'm gonna go in with this revolution palette and i'm gonna go in with the black and i'm just basically gonna give myself a little eyeliner this is a dupe for the Fenty Beauty lip gloss, 100%. Like, ah, look at that. But I am a lip gloss girl. I will forever be a lip gloss girl, and I just pack it on. It's been a problem in past relationships. I, relationships have had to end because of my lip gloss problem. I will continue to reapply this lip gloss for the rest of the night, period. If 
the weather isn't nice, I'm literally gonna be depressed. Cause I'm a vampire. Like I, I have no idea how it looks on camera, but. So now we are going to see the dresses that I got from Fashion Nova. So option number one, do we like? Do we not like? I feel like it's giving very much Barbie vibes, like Barbie and Ken. It's a little bit short, which is a bit concerning. Because I thought it wasn't going to look too good just because I am part of the Edie Beauty community. So I thought it wasn't going to look good because, you know, the fashion of models, their boobs are humongous. Like, I can't keep up. So I didn't think it was going to look cute, but you can adjust the front. And it doesn't look bad. And yes, I'm taking a snack break. Um, my grandma put me on. So back to what I was saying, dress number one. It's very cute, it's just not the moment for tonight, but it is very comfortable. So let's let's try on the other options. Okay, she's cute. Okay, she's cute. Okay. Brown is kind of giving today. Second of all, it's super comfortable. Super comfortable. And third, this little this little back moment. I feel like this could be this could be what we're going for tonight. Uh, and it is raining outside, so I feel like it's appropriate to wear kind of like a darker color. I'm trying to match Mother Nature, so I feel like brown for the mud. It's working. Okay, this is option four. She's cute. Okay, first of all, I have to point out it is knit. It's like knitted. It's very like tight on my skin, which I like feeling like I can't breathe. Tie it up on your on the back. It's also kind of like an open back. Not as much as the other one, but honestly, between this one and the brown one, I feel like I'm leaning more towards this one. So it's so far, I feel like it's gonna be between this one and the brown one, but I do feel like this one is complimenting me a little bit more right now. I, I feel prettier in this dress than I do in the brown one. So I already have a dress like this that I also got from Fashion Nova, but it's more of a nude color. And the other one that I have is, it goes all the way down. Like this one has cuts on the sides, which I feel like makes it look a little bit better. Cause bitch. She's definitely a moment, she's she's a little bit too much for tonight. A little, this is too much. Um, I look like I'm going to a red carpet, which nothing wrong with that, just not for today. Oof, shit. Runway walk, runway walk, please. Oh, shit. Ow! You didn't see anything. Okay, this dress is fucking pretty, though. Like a little... Okay, this is a 10 out of 10. Obviously, it's a bit much, but definitely, definitely very cute for a date. Hello? Can I help you? This is the hoe of the group. This dress is screaming single. This dress is screaming, take me to the club, give me five shots, and let me dance some. You know I like this dress when I already have it in red. Please. I like to dance a lot and I like to go out a lot, so I feel like dresses are very convenient for that. Bitch. <laughs> Why did I get so many black dresses? We got this going on in the back. This is very like business, let's talk money. Oh, she's cute. Literally such a breathable and comfortable material. It's also very like tight on the skin, which I like. And I had never seen a dress where you literally just, you literally just slide your hand through. Like who thought of that? It's cute, but not, not for tonight. It's cute, but not for tonight. 10 out of 10. And last but not least, this is what we, I look like I'm going to a wedding. Definitely not my wedding, but this is more of like a girly, girly look. So it has this layer at the bottom and then a mesh layer on top. I feel like this would be for like a picnic, maybe like a wedding day. Always the bridesmaid, never the bride. That's pretty much it. I think I've made my choice. I think I know what I'm wearing. I think I know what I'm wearing. Take a guess, the next clip is gonna be me wearing the outfits for tonight.